an analysis of convolution neural network for image classification using different models. Abstract this paper presents an analysis of the performance of the convolution neural networks, CNNs, for image identification and recognition using different nets. A variety of nets are available to test the performance of the different networks. Popular benchmark datasets like ImageNet, CIFAR10, CIFAR100 are used to test the performance of a convolution neural network. This study focuses on analysis of three popular networks, VGG16, VGG19, and ResNet50 on ImageNet dataset. These three networks are first realized using Keras and TensorFlow for image classification on ImageNet dataset. The random set of annotated images from the internet are subjected to these three networks for classification and analyzed for accuracy. It is observed that the ResNet50 is able to recognize images with better precision compared to VGG16 and VGG19. Keywords, convolution neural networks, image classification, ImageNet, VGG16, VGG19, ResNet50, Keras, TensorFlow. I. Introduction. Artificial intelligence, AI, is a multidisciplinary science that includes in making smart machines capable to perform tasks that are analogous to human intelligence. It is an intelligence shown by machines, similar to the natural intelligence displayed by humans and animals to ideally validate and perform actions that will achieve a specific goal in a better way. Deep learning or deep structured learning is a part of a broader family of machine learning techniques based on artificial neural networks. In deep learning, artificial neurons in the networks examine the large data set and it will inevitably determine the underlying patterns without human interference one. In deep learning, a model slash network learns to perform classification tasks on images, text, or sound. Deep learning models can achieve state-of-the-art accuracy on image recognition and classification, sometimes exceeding human-level performance too. Computer vision has various applications like image classification 3, image recognition and object detection 4. Among those, image detection 5 is considered as the fundamental application and forms the basis for other computer vision applications 6. Nowadays internet has an abundance of images, which is very handy for the development of applications and algorithms. There are major advances in image labeling, object detection, image recognition areas across the world 7. Artificial neural networks have been used extensively for object detection 4 and recognition and this work focuses on suggesting a suitable architecture slash network for image recognition and image classification 8. Datasets like ImageNet 9, LabelMe 10 etc. that have millions of high-resolution labeled images and are freely available to build neural network models. These images belong to thousands of different categories. In 2012 a large deep convolution neural network, called AlexNet 11, designed by Krich Hefsky showed excellent performance on the ImageNet Large Scale Visual Recognition Challenge, Elsvirk, 1220. The success of AlexNet has become the inspiration of different CNN models such as CFNet 13, VGGNet 14, GoogleNet 15, ResNet 16, DenseNet 17, CapsNet 18, Senet 19 etc. in the following years. Elsvirk commonly called as ImageNet is an image dataset that is built according to the WordNet hierarchy. According to WordNet hierarchy, the words and similar word phrases are grouped to form synonym set or synset. More than 100,000 synsets in WordNet are designed to provide on an average of 1,000 images to demonstrate each synset in ImageNet. Every images are human annotated and quality controlled. ImageNet 20 will offer tens of millions of efficiently sorted images for maximum of the models in the WordNet hierarchy. In this work, pre-trained VGG16, VGG19 and ResNet50 have been realized using Keras and TensorFlow and is deployed using Python for image detection. The selected models have been trained using millions of human annotated images of ImageNet dataset. Random images from the internet are then used for classification. The results are analyzed with respect to accuracy of prediction. A convolutional neural network, a deep learning algorithm, can take an input image, assign importance to several aspects slash objects in the image and be able to distinguish one from the other. A typical CNN is composed of single or multiple blocks of convolution and subsampling layers, after that one or more fully connected layers and an output layer is shown in figure 1. A convolutional layer. The convolutional layer, CONV layer, is the central part of a CNN. In a large input image, a small section of the image is considered and we convolve them into a single output using a filter, kernel. Fig 2 shows typical convolutional operation. B subsampling or pooling layer. Pooling merely means downsampling of an image. It takes small region of the convolutional output as input and subsamples it to produce a single output. Different pooling techniques like max pooling, mean pooling, average pooling is available. Max pooling takes largest of the pixel values of a region as shown in figure 3. See nonlinear layers. Neural networks and CNNs in precise rely on a nonlinear trigger function to signal identification of likely features on every hidden layer. CNNs may use a range of certain functions such as rectified linear units, ReLU, and continuous trigger, nonlinear, functions to proficiently implement this nonlinear triggering. ReLU a ReLU implements the function y equals max, x0, thus the input and output sizes of this layer will be the same. It rises the nonlinear properties of the decision function and of the overall network without affecting any of the receptive fields of the convolution layer. ReLU layer functionality is demonstrated in figure 4, with its transfer function plotted over the arrow. D fully connected layer, FC layer. Fully connected, FC, layers are always used as the last layers of a CNN. This layer takes input from all neurons in the previous layer and performs arithmetic sum of the preceding layer of features with individual neuron in the current layer to generate output as shown in figure 5. Three dot different models of CNN available for image classification. VGGNet Visual Geometry Group. Simonian and Zisserman used deeper configuration of AlexNet 21, and they proposed it as VGGNet 14. VGGNet comes in two different flavors, VGG16 and VGG19, where 16 and 19 are the total number of layers in each of them correspondingly. VGGNet was born out of the need to reduce the number of parameters in the CONV layers and improve on training time 27. The variations of VGGNet are discussed below. A VGG16. VGG16, a flavor of VGGNet, is a convolution neural net, CNN, architecture was used to win Elsevier, ImageNet, contest in 2014-14. The most unique thing about this VGG16 is that instead of taking a large number of hyperparameters they concentrated on having convolution layers with 3x3 filter and with a stride 1 and continually used max pole layer of 2x2 filter of stride 2 and same padding. It follows this procedure of max pool and convolution layers steadily throughout the complete architecture. In the end it has two fully connected layers, FC, followed by a soft max for the output. VGG1614, the 16 here refers to it has 16 layers that have weights. The input to the network is image of dimensions, 224, 224, 3, 22. The first two layers have 64 channels of 3 asterisk 3 filter size and same padding and then a max pool layer of stride, 2, 2. Again, two layers which have convolution layers of 128 and filter size, 3, 3, a max pooling layer of stride, 2, 2. 
Then there are two convolution layers of filter size, 3, 3, and 256 filter. There are two sets of three convolution layer and a max pool layer. Each have 512 filters of, 3, 3, size with same padding. Followingly there are three fully connected layer 23, the first layer takes input from the last feature vector and outputs a, 1, 4096, vector, second layer also outputs a vector of size, 1, 4096, but the third layer outputs 1000 channels for 1000 classes of Ellsberg challenge, then after the output of third fully connected layer is passed to softmax layer in order to normalize the classification vector 24. BVGG19. The Visual Geometry Group Network, VGGNet, is a deep neural network with a multilayered operation. The VGGNet is based on the CNN model and is applied on the ImageNet dataset 21. VGG19 is useful due to its simplicity as 3 times 3 convolutional layers are mounted on the top to increase with depth level. To reduce the volume size, max pooling layers were used as a handler in VGG1914. 2 FC layers were used with 4096 neurons. In the training phase, convolutional layers were used for the feature extraction and max pooling layers associated with some of the convolutional layers to reduce the feature dimensionality. In the first convolutional layer, 64 kernels, 3 times 3 filter size, were applied for feature extraction from the input images. Fully connected layers were used to prepare the feature vector. See ResNet 50. From the past two CNNs, it has seen nothing but a rising number of layers in the design, and for achieving better performance of the design. But with the network depth rising slash increasing, accuracy grows saturated and then reduces rapidly. The guys from Microsoft Research focus this problem with ResNet by means of skip connections, aka shortcut connections, residuals, whilst building deeper models. ResNet architecture is one of the initial adopters of batch normalization 25. The deeper CNN stacked up with more layers suffers from vanishing gradient problem. To solve this problem, pre-trained shallower model is used with additional layers to perform identity mapping. So that the performance of deeper network and the shallower network should be similar. The deep residual learning framework 26 is introduced as a solution to the degradation problem. Hence, included residual mapping, h, x, equals f, x, plus x, instead of desired underlying mapping, h, x, into the network and named the model as ResNet 26. ResNet architecture consists of stacked residual blocks of 3 times 3 convolutional layers. They have periodically doubled the number of filters and used a stride of 2. Fig 8a and 8b shows a plane layer and residual block. The architecture of ResNet 50 is as shown in the figure 9. The input to the network is image of dimensions, 224, 224, 3, and this image is given to 4 stages as shown in the figure. Then the image undergoes average pooling, this output is subjected to fully connected that outputs 1000 channels for 1000 classes of Ellsworth Net. 4. Dot experiments and results. Keras, a deep learning API written in Python, latest version 3.7.6 is used, and TensorFlow 2.0 is used to realize the pre-trained models of VGG16, VGG19, and ResNet50. These models have been pre-trained with ImageNet dataset that has tens of millions of human annotated images. Different images belonging to different classes have been chosen from internet for image classification. We have chosen 50 different varieties of images like animals, birds, fruits, vegetables, object images like guitar, umbrella etc., for compiling the analysis of prediction using different nets. Different models have given different prediction values for a given image. For example, when Fig10 was subjected for image prediction, the network predicts it as an African elephant by ResNet50, VGG16 and VGG19 with a prediction accuracy as 0 0.7855, 0 0.6805 and 0.7147 respectively. Similarly, Fig11 is predicted as an umbrella with 0 0.9869, 0 0.7588, 0 0.7213 prediction accuracy by ResNet50, VGG16 and VGG19 nets respectively. Fig12 was subjected to the ResNet50, VGG16, and VGG19 nets, it is predicted as pineapple with a prediction accuracy of 0 0.9998, 0 0.9958, and 0 0.9558 respectively. V. Discussions. Image classification using three different architectures. ResNet50, VGG16, and VGG19 architectures are trained based on ImageNet dataset to identify and classify images. A random set of 50 images are chosen for our analysis and these images are given to ResNet50, VGG16, and VGG19 architectures. Different models gives different prediction values for a given image. For every image, precision values are noted and compared with the other nets. For every image, the distribution of different precision values for ResNet50, VGG16 and VGG19 is plotted as in Figure 13, Figure 14 and Figure 15 respectively. The x-axis in the chart represent the input set of 50 images and the y-axis represent the prediction value of the images. Image recognition using ResNet50 architecture. Image recognition using VGG16 architecture. Image recognition using VGG19 architecture. Comparison of images prediction values ResNet50, VGG16, VGG19. The Figure 14 shows the comparison of predicted values for every image. Each image is subjected to ResNet50, VGG16 and VGG19 architectures for image identification. Depending on the architecture and based on the data set, CNN predicts the particular image and gives the result with prediction accuracy. Each architecture varies in the value of prediction of the same image. This variation for different precision values for all the images is shown in the figure 17 for three different architectures. The CNN is realized using different architectures for different images and their precision values are analyzed. Based on the work, ResNet50 gives the highest accuracy for the given image when compared to VGG16 and VGG19. The network depth of the ResNets are larger and achieves better accuracy while being computationally more efficient than VGGNet. The architecture of ResNet50 is similar to the VGGNet consisting mostly of 3x3 filters except the shortcut connection is inserted in residual network. This residual network overcomes the vanishing gradient problem or degradation problem enhance giving a better accuracy compared with VGG16 and VGG19 based on the pre-trained architectures a particular image is recognized. This precision accuracy depends on how well the networks are trained in the particular data set. The graph in figure 18 shows the highest accuracy using ResNet50 architecture for all the images. 6. Conclusion In this paper, a deep learning convolutional neural network based on Keras and TensorFlow is deployed using Python for image classification. This paper analyzed the prediction accuracy of three different convolutional neural network, CNN, on most popular ImageNet dataset. The main purpose of this paper is to find out the accuracy of the different networks on same data set and evaluating the consistency of prediction by each of the CNN. We have presented a detailed prediction analysis for comparing the network's performance for different images. The images are subjected to VGG16, VGG19, and ResNet50 networks and the prediction values are evaluated. 
The analysis shows that Resonant 50 able to recognize images with better precision compared to VGG16 and VGG19. The future enhancement will focus on other high-level nets. Future works will be dedicated to investigating the other pre-trained models for the classification task.